All right, do you struggle a lot losing the ball? Let's say big high rights, uh, really getting weak distance. Uh, many times it's not your swing, believe it or not. It's actually one thing you're doing critically wrong with your grip and it just stops you from being able to get any power and any real control of that club face. And then with one simple tweak, we can go from like no yardage, 128 yards, and you make that tiny change in your grip, and you get massive amounts more club head speed, 163. So we're gonna make that change so you can solve a ton of problems right now. All right, so when you're gripping the golf club, there are numerous ways to do it. And let's see, I'll take off my glove hand, my glove so we can see. So when we grip, we wanna make sure that we're not making this mistake and it is gripping the club in your first palm. This would be a huge mistake, okay? Uh, first pad, second pad. A lot of times people grip the club, they send the grip handle right through the pads, like so, and that's, that's a big mistake, getting them through the center of, of the pads. Even this, is not good there. You see how we're still up on that front pad. Anytime your grip is focused on the front pad, your shots are gonna look something like this. For the most part, 120 yard seven iron, no yardage, high right. So we've got to get it off that front pad and onto this back pad. And there's two ways kind of to get it on that back pad. One is you can turn your hand over to the, to the right, and this is more of a stronger grip, okay, like so, and that does get it on that back pad, but it makes you have this super strong grip. It's not a horrible thing, it's just not the most ideal scenario. So what we wanna do is, the best way that I have found to do it is to really put your hand out and then kick your hand down like this, all right? And then the club will sit in your fingertips here, okay? You can set your clubs in your fingertips and then that back pad is on top of the grip handle, right, like so. So get your hand out, kick it down, then grab the club handle with your left hand and you could see my pad is right where it needs to be. Now you have total control over that golf club and my grip isn't so strong. And then this thumb would be all tucked in, everything is nicely put together and then you put your right hand on. We've I have other videos about that, but this is just left hand video. Now, when you have that on there securely, you're good to go, okay? And you know you're on there good because you can hit shots left-handed, just like that. You're gonna have so much control over that club that you're gonna be able to hit little shots just left-handed. You couldn't really do that very well on that front pad. So get that on there, like so. Down here, kick your hand down, then put your club in your fingers and set it down. Now you're good to go in terms of your left hand. Your right hand is, you receive that club underneath. Now you can really control that golf club through the swing. Remember, if you're struggling up top here, many times it could just very well be your grip and how you're grabbing that club. And the best way to do it is fix your grip first 
make sure that's good to go, then a lot of things will work themselves out in your golf swing. Same thing with the glove. There you go, you're all set. Set and it just feels like you have got control over the club. If the club's feeling too heavy, then chances are you have a poor grip. So make that adjustment. You just feel it right here. There you go, now we're good. Yeah, now you can feel it. It's in there securely and you can control the club throughout the entire swing. There you go. So a quick little fix up on your grip. Don't get sloppy with this because it will affect the rest of your swing. So be precise with your grip, shore it up. Don't start changing your swing if you're not gripping the club correctly. Little fix up on our grips. Uh, don't get sloppy here. You can make some huge costly mistakes with just a little, a little error in how you grab that club. Hope it helps. Thanks for watching. Love you guys. See you soon.